Well, for today's mushing adventure, we're doing something kind of unique. We're doing a, um, a one-way go. So today, Carrie is doing my shuttle for me, and she's dropping us off. And we're going to go six miles down this rail trail back on home. So we're going one way. So once Carrie takes off, we're committed. So thank you, Carrie, for being our shuttle driver. Yeah, my pleasure. And we'll get the dogs hooked up. And um, it's going to be getting dark. So what do we have in case it gets dark? Lantern. Got the lantern, all right, just in case there's any snowmobiles out here. But I'm going to get the dogs hooked up, and we're going to get going. You want to hear something funny? Yeah. I was ready for you to say, Alexa, start recording. <laughs> <laughs> I used to go for, for that. All right, Carrie. I love you. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Okay. Love you. Thank you. Here we go. Hang on. All right, good. Let's go. Hup, hup, hup. Come on. of snow today so we have just a lightest layer over this most of this is kind of crud so you see how the dogs are trying to find the sock of snow and my sled is actually riding over some pretty uh, chunky frozen globs of ice <laughs> but the dogs like the fresh stuff and this little quarter inch of snow gives us a great layer to slide on. We're going good dogs. We're taking a little breather right now but while we do that I wanted to show you something that I'm using for the first time today. So obviously here are the dogs <laughs> in their harness. There's their gang line. Their tug lines coming to the gang line. There's the bungee and there's everything connected to the bridle of the sled. And then you can see that green line goes off to my snow hook. So my snow hook is what's holding them right now. And I just replaced my old line that I had the snow hook attached to um, this morning. And it's probably about five inches shorter than I would like it to be. But all the same, it's holding. I can adjust it later. Our last snowstorm is kind of wet and heavy and so there's a lot of these low-hanging birch trees Lost my hat. Stand. All right, I have retrieved my hat. That is the second time that's knocked uh, a tree has knocked off my head today. Let's go. It's wonderful though. We aren't seeing anybody out here at all. Oh, a little rocky. Again, you can 
see how the dogs go into the soft snow to avoid the hard ice that my sled goes through. So this bridge over here in the swamp, this is about our halfway mark, or maybe three, maybe a little bit more than that miles from the end where Carrie is waiting for us. The dogs have done pretty well. Um, like I said, the, the chunky snow is a little, they have to be careful with their feet and I respect that. And so they're being very smart and taking it easy, but we're still enjoying a day out dog sledding in Massachusetts. Well, this is a little surprising. As we were going over the bridge there, I was looking across the swamp and I saw a bald eagle nest that I hadn't seen before. So that's pretty exciting. I think right now in Massachusetts, we have 75 to 100, maybe more, uh, breeding pairs of bald eagles. Um, anyway, it's exciting to see them come back. I'm gonna have to keep an eye on this in the spring and see if I see the eagles when they return to nest. All right, so this time, now we have a tree that we have to go over. So, all right, up, up, up. Yep, good dogs, up. Yep, good, easy, easy. Uh, come on, let's go. Good. All right. Well, we're up and over. I got a little puddle up ahead here. Let the dogs take a drink. Uh, she was interested. Bandit isn't. That's odd. Bandit's usually the water dog. All right, well, if you don't want, let's go. Hop. There we go. So Shiva decides she wants to cool off for a little bit. So she's taking a roll in the snow. It is kind of warm. It's about 30 degrees. But she loves to roll in the snow. <laughs> There we go. All right, now we're set. All right, hang on. Okay, let's go. Up, up. There we go. Now that we're getting closer to home, my home in Templeton, the snow is a lot softer and deeper. Um, we really did get the jackpot out of that last storm. So the dogs are liking this on their feet. Better than I kind of took the ice earlier. Well, it's just after four o'clock, it's starting to get dark. We probably have about 20 minutes of dusk left. We may be reaching carry in the dark. obstacle we've seen today got a fallen tree right across right all over ha no ha ha no no ha ha no ahead 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 no come on ahead 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 no no ha up no 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 come on no no come here no no Fiasco. All right, come on. There we go. They wanted to go under that tree. But they couldn't understand I was telling them to go left. 
still over. Be dark when we get there. Well, this is by far the best snow we've seen. It's getting deep now. 